Welcome to the channel of Coach M. Redfield. This is the Super Shadow Play performed at Chan Wei Table Tennis Club. This is the part one focused on the fundamental movement and transition in table tennis. There are seven exercises that every young player must learn. First, small exchange, the small transition around the center of gravity. Second, forehand two point attack. Basic footwork to use the forehand at the middle of the table and at the wide forehand position. You can use this shadow player to learn the basic pattern in table tennis. It is very important to the new players. Repetition is the key. You will improve and correct your bad habit by doing this job every day. Within only 4 minutes, you will learn the basic footwork pattern in table tennis. Always incorporate your body into the stroke. Make a small step between a big movement to gain the consistency. Number 3. Forehand two-point attack with the transition from the backhand drive. These patterns are based on the real situation in match. By training this situation, you can improve quickly your play in the real match. Quick backhand right and then pivot to attack the next ball. Number 4. Backhand attack at 2 points. With a backhand attack, consistency is the key because it is harder to make a powerful shot with the backhand than with the forehand. So focus on the consistency of the stroke. Number 5. Forehand attack at the pivot and then at the wide forehand position. This exercise will help you learn the big step in table tennis how to move the wide range and then quickly recover to attack continuously. Number 6. Relax. Learn the backhand to forehand transition at the basic stance. You can notice that even when you don't need to move, but you should rotate your body and use a lot of your weight to generate the power of the stroke. This principle applies for both forehand and backhand shot. Look at how this player rotates their hips. And finally, number 7. Forehand two points attack with the transition of the backhand. This is the most common situation in table tennis, so you need to repeat this exercise. Number 8. 